everyone welcome back to microbio solutions today we are going to discuss about the capsule staining of bacteria as you know bacterial capsule is a large structure which is common to many bacteria most of the bacteria contains capsule which is a polysaccharide layer which lies outside the cell envelope bacteria has a bacterial cell and a bacteria if it possesses a capsule which will be seen outside the cell envelope and it thus it is deemed to be a part of outer bacterial cell wall and capsule staining which is diagnostically useful since it is a virulence factor example in case of pneumococci and bacterial capsules are non ionic so neither acidic or basic stains will adhere to their surfaces so it is important to know about the capsule staining which is deemed to be a part of outer cell wall of the bacterium capsule staining is diagnostically useful since it is a virulent factor as in case of pneumococci and the bacterial capsules are non ionic so neither acid or basic stains will adhere to their surfaces so it is important to know the staining techniques for capsule and they are demonstrated either by negative staining that is by using nigrosin or india ink or by special staining examples is his method and anthony's method today we are going to see about his method the procedure of his method will be discussed here today so in his method as the capsule is non ionic in nature so it does not get stained by an acidic stain but a basic stain the basic stains includes crystal violet which stains the cell wall as well as the capsule so this is followed by the treatment of an hypotonic solution that is 20% cuso4 or copper sulfate which serves dual role of both the decolorizing as well as the counter stain so in his method we have crystal violet a basic stain as a primary stain and copper sulfate that is 20% of copper sulfate solution which acts as both decolorizer and a counter stain the copper sulfate solution being hypotonic causes the diffusion of stain towards the outer surface of cell so to do the his method or his technique for capsule staining we need to prepare a smear air dry but do not heat fix the smear and once you have prepared your smear you have to flood the smear with crystal violet that is your primary stain for about 4 to 5 minutes at the end of 5 minutes you can rinse the slide with 20% copper sulfate solution which will act as a decolorizer as well as the counter stain do not use water to wash the smear and once you wash the smear with 20% cuso4 air dry the smear and observe it under oil immersion objective after drying of slide the stain which is not passed from the capsular layer during diffusion retains in the capsular layer and copper sulfate then decolorizes the capsule so that the capsule appears as a faint blue halo around a purple cell that is how we will appreciate the capsule staining by his method that is about his staining or his method of capsule staining if you have any doubts please put your doubts in the comment section and please do like share and subscribe to our channel thank you